Ratnam. Thank you for joining me. I'm Dharamkar, and we're going to be doing a series of long Akankars. The kitty has already started his. So, um, we're going to be breathing in very sharply through our sinuses, up into this area, through the gunas of the nose, and we're going to be hitting this area here where our sinuses are as we do this. If we're going to be looking anywhere, it's going to be towards the tip of the nose. The eyes come down, cross-eyed somewhat, lightly. Uh, focused on the tip of the nose. Soft gaze. Uh, what Yogi Bhajan called the bedroom eyes gaze. So, we're going to be exhaling as we chant our long ekankars. Please join me. We're going to be doing this for three minutes. Thank you. Ek onkar Siriwa he guru Ek on ka siriwa he guru Ek on ka siriwa he guru Siriwa he guru Ek on ka 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 Siriwa Siriwa he guru Ek on ka 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 Siriwa He Guru Now that we've come back, I hope that you let that resonate all through the front of your skull up into here, through your sinus cavities, through your throat chakra, all the way down to your heart center. Thank you so much for joining me. With every breath, you can feel the posture realigning, 
the shoulders squaring, sitting up a little straighter, and sounding a little more resonant. This exercise helps vibrate your aura out and grow that auric field. It also allows your, your gunas to focus, all of your holes all over your body, they focus. Where our senses are usually hungry, they can now give out the positive vibrations. Thank you so, so much for joining me. There are so many things that this exercise and many others can show you on vibration. So I hope so much that this very simple introduction to Kriya and Mudra and Mantra, more Mantra, has helped you. Um, see you next time. Satnam. Peace and many blessings. Thank you for joining me here on Mystic Ashram. Have a wonderful day.